using ratios to solve three term word problems with changing quantities. Anna, Bruce, and Elvis shared a bottle of soda. The ratio of the amount of soda Anna received to the amount Bruce received to the amount Elvis received was 5 to 7 to 3. Anna took 80 milliliters less soda than Bruce. How much of his soda should Bruce give to Elvis so that the three have the same amount in their cups? Well, let's start off with this ratio. I know that Anna to Bruce to Elvis was in a five to seven to three ratio. I also know that Anna took 80 milliliters less soda than Bruce. If I calculate the difference between their units, seven minus five gives me two units. And I know that it was 80 milliliters less soda between those two units. That's going to give me 80 milliliters per unit. That will allow me now to figure out how much soda each of them had. So A, B, and C at 40 milliliters per unit, Anna had 200, Bruce had 280, and Elvis, sorry, this should be E, Elvis had 120. So now we figured out how much they each have. Now, the only problem is the question doesn't ask that. The question asks how much of his soda should Bruce give to Elvis so that the three have the same amount in their cups? Well, from this, I can see that if Bruce gives up 80 milliliters, if I subtract 80, and I give that to Elvis 80, the new totals will be 200 for Anna, 200 for Bruce, and 200 for Elvis. So the final answer to this question is 80 milliliters which is the amount that Bruce should give to Elvis so that they all have the same amount.